Most of South Korea's cases of COVID-19 have been traced to an infected 61-year-old woman who attended a church service, an act health officials described as a super-spreading event. In response to the outbreak, the South Korean government has set up temporary medical facilities to treat patients with the virus and focused its efforts on two southeastern cities where a majority of the cases have been discovered. The government will take special measures by designating the Daegu and Chengdu areas as special care zones, as the sudden hike in numbers of the confirmed cases have been reported from there. Fears of COVID-19 have dealt a double blow to Chinatown districts in South Korea, with both locals and tourists staying away. The owner of this Chinese restaurant says he's lost 90 percent of his customers since the outbreak. We really don't know what to do. It's that serious. We are just waiting every day, hoping that it will be better tomorrow. Currently, about 40 percent of stores in Chinatown are closed. People who live in the cities most affected are being urged to stay indoors, and the South Korean military said it's decided to confine troops to their bases until further notice.